Welcome to Rimworld. My name is Mertorius and welcome to this noob session. This is a series where you're going to teach me how to play Rimworld. And we just started this episode with a raid. This is Harold. Harold is going to attack us. He's only got a knife. But he's pretty good at shooting and he also likes a little bit of mining plants. So he would be a perfect prisoner. And we're going to capture him. I hope. So we're not going to attack him because I learned that playing the defensive game is working pretty good. All right, we got the batteries. That's also something I wanted. So we're going to do the solar next. And I guess we do need to do something with all these sand rocks. So if you haven't already put it in the comment of the last episode, Put it in, what is this? Pirates from Grasshoppers of Power are beginning their assault. Where are you now? You're over there. So you're, you're beginning your assault. All right. Uh, we're going to position our guys. Uh, we got one chicken, chicken fox. Uh, fox doesn't like violence, so he is going to go and keep researching through the whole attack. And we got two guys who can barely shoot, but yeah, we're going to make them shoot. Put them on guard duty. Look at them. Ragnus, Ragnus is like a Pignus is really looking pretty cool with his bold rival. Also is, oh man, I keep forgetting that name. Kray Zaz Kray's, my teacher. He's, he's taught me most of this game. Pretty cool guy with a lot of patience of teaching a noob. All right, so here is the, I built this wall so they have to come around it and I have a long distance shot. But I guess something will go wrong in the future soon. Come on. Yeah, you hit him. Maybe we should put some traps there. All right. Come on. You shot teacher. Ragnus isn't a pretty good close range shooter. All right. You don't like dead bodies, do you? Can we see that? Because this is the second time you got disgusted by seeing a dead body. Why jokes? No. Can we see that? Something about his... Harold expired. Yes, that's kind of... Oh, he's already dead. Damn, he went went bad soon. Teacher hit Harold with a shovel from his revolver barrel, jabbing her, her left hand. Harold swung her knife at Teacher, but be hesitated and this last second. Teacher missed while trying to shove Harold. With a revolver barrel, so mm. so that guy's already dead. That's kind of pity. Um, I guess we do need to build a burial site or something like that. Didn't I already build one? Because there's also a dead body here. Well, we we kind of need a burial cemetery or something like that. I guess we are going to build one. I'm not quite sure who is going to build it, but I do know. There should be something. Yes, there it is. So I guess we're going to build a few here. We're going to strip her. All right, and we're going to bury those guys. Uh, you are going to be stripped as well. And you are going straight to bed. You're going to go in the medical bed. And I guess you are going to do some working. <coughs> and I hope, why is my apology? Why is it going to heal? You're the medical, aren't you not? Yes, you are. You're going to heal teacher up a little bit. So this raid went pretty, well, kind of bad because I really wanted to have that guy capture him. And 
I guess I need to expand this even more. I really need to do something with these these things. I'm not quite sure what we're going to do with them. So if you get some tips and tricks what we should do with them, uh, give them in the comment down below. And we're going to do that in the next episode. Or at least in, maybe in the episode after that one. But because we got a lot of things to do. Crappy steel knife. Alright, so you're bearing... Oh no, you're making the graves. Yeah, that's a job that has to be done. Then we're already making... Ooh, is this this money? Yes, this is silver. Alright, we're going to do that soon. But I, I need some extra space and... I need to make a room for the berries. And I guess the sun is most of the time somewhere over here so I don't want to have those conduits of the electricity going under my I should have planned this a little bit better because this is all in the shadow as you can see there's a lot of sun over there but maybe we can build a battery room in here or something like this because this is this is all marble hmm. it's kind of annoying all right, so we're going to build a battery room somewhere in here. I don't know how much page I'm going to need for that, but we'll see, we'll see. There is plenty of room in here. And this is good. This is going to be the battery room, I guess. Far away from everything that can burn. And let's take a look at Ragnus, if he's already done. What is he doing? Oh, he's carrying his the pants. Oh, this would have been the perfect wife for Fox. Cargo pod. Where is the cargo pod? Jump. Two cargo pods. Something is going to happen? No. Yes, crap. Some leather stuff. It probably is good, but I have no idea what to do with it. And some steel, a lot of steel, but we got plenty of steel stuff. I was hoping for a guy or a girl or something like that. So let's speed it all up and... You're going to eat a bit, you're going to take the body, that's a smart thing. That's a pretty smart thing. You're taking the body first. How much food do we have left? We got six food left. We definitely need to mine a breakdown again. Colonists need beds, warmer clothing. Yes, uh, I guess we all need. We all got a need. Medical emergency. Oh, God, you need to focus. Can I prioritize? Why not? Strip teacher. This teacher, is that the medical one? No. Oh, shoot. It is. All right. So I guess we're slowly going to lose. We're already getting, going to lose our medical specialist. I shouldn't have put that one in the front line. Oh, man. Oh, man. I hope you're going to get well. His head. He's got stabbed in the head. Oh my god. Oh my god. He's bleeding. He's he's gone. Oh no. We've lost him. Why couldn't we heal him? Now I got no medical guy. All right. I guess we are definitely going to have a need of a medical guy. <laughs> Look at the room. It's kind of messy. And we've lost, lost my teacher. I hope my teacher is going to not take this pretty bad. A friend AI passed named Charles Winchstone has sent a message. He reveals that he has a starship hidden on his planet. All right. And send you uh, words. All right, coordinates. The starship is currently deep hibernating mode. You will have to start it up when you arrive. Then defend it from the raiders trying to steal it until 
the startup sequence is complete. Jump to the location. Alright, so we're kind of jumping to a location. That's pretty far away. Holy crap, we are somewhere. I, I haven't told you guys that, but we where are we anyway? Where's my pause? Transport pod crash. Oh man, I, this is this is one of the hardest episodes. I need help. I definitely need help. Uh, first, how am I going to locate where I am? Where am I? No, that's not going to help. All right, so this is where the ship is, land ship. And how am I going to get, well, all right, so they're already back. If you know how to get to the map and know the location where we drop, because I kind of forgot where we put ourselves on the map. Uh, now I do need to see what you guys are doing. You're burying teacher. All right, that's a good thing. And you're studying again. <laughs> All right. And there's pro transport part. Oh, great. Uh, I guess you capture. I guess if he's he's. Let's see his needs. Medical step step. Oh, pain is extreme. This I am not going to be able to save this guy. Bleeding to death in eight hours. Uh, we're going to make this a prisoner bed and combine medical bed. Can that be? Yes, that can be. All right, and we're going to put you capture the pilot. I'm not sure if I can save this guy. I, I kind of know I, I'm not going to be able to save this guy. So we're just filling up another grave. And I don't want to fill up more graves. It all went so nice. Is he, can we, can we save him? Oh, come on. Next time I'm going to, can you save him? Can you? Yeah, you can clean the blood. Well, at least do that. Then we don't get infections and that kind of things. Yeah, I know we got a medical emergency. Disease infections. <laughs> oh my god. Has gotten sick of infections in his her left leg. Alright, so it's even a girl. I didn't even notice that. So I guess you are going to die. In three hours. In two hours. Well, I really need some teaching in how to save people without... Without any medical, yes, he's already dead. I was expecting that. All right, our grays are filling up pretty bad and fast. Where are you taking that guy? Oh yeah, we made a corpse area. I forgot all about that. This is a stockpile zone where we take corpses. All right, kind of funny. Going to spoil uh, in a lot of time, and now I guess major breakdown risk. Yes, I I would know. All right, teacher has died, cause of blood loss. Well, and he's buried there. And I guess you can do a lot more because you can now mine too. <clears throat> and you can also grow plants and that kind of stuff because you need to do everything. And I guess... You guys can be doctors. Oh my god, I could have saved him. Oh man. All right, next one we are going to save. We're definitely going to save people now. You 
You guys have a lot of things to do. You are going to harvest the potatoes here, so you're going to make us some food. We we'll definitely need a raid. Oh no, come on, jump to location. Can we make traps or something like that? Uh, oh, ah! Order. I need. I need a wall here, and I need traps. I need traps. We're not going to lose any more power people um, because Wise isn't capable of fighting. So I guess we are going to. Uh, defense, defense, security, spike trap, put one spike trap there, and you're going to prioritize that, you're going to, cannot, cannot, oh great, you're on hell of a guy. And you're going to be draft as do you. Alright, he's being attacked by our yak. I guess I'm going to make a door or something like that. So that we can attack them in the back. We're going to be a little bit sneaky. Alright, Ragnas, you are going to do it. Because this guy looks badass. A yak cave child. But he's pretty good. So we are pretty good. He can construct. He's an undergrounder. I don't like undergrounders, but... We're already shooting him. He's pulling back. Alright. He's pulling back. Let's go and attack that guy. Come on, you got to hit something. All right, all right. Oh, you killed him. Maybe we shouldn't... Ah, maybe we shouldn't do the shooting thing. But how can I... How can I capture people without... Shakila has been beaten to death. Oh, that Shakila was a wise. Shakila was bonded with the wise. All right, it will affect his mood. Well, bury it. Don't tell him. Don't tell him at all. Is he? Is he affected? No, no. You're just a little bit stressed. Oh, he healed. He healed the. the oh, cool. I guess we they are they are helpful. So can we train them? Can we can we? I don't want to slaughter you. Ragnus, can you? No, you can only slaughter them. That's kind of end of wise. Can you? You can only slaughter them too. That that's kind of strange. Well, at least we got food. And we got some defenses. What's this? Why is, is having a tantrum? What the hell is a tantrum? He's going to smash things in his room. This happened because of poor mood. <laughs> All right. All right, you can smash your room. <laughs> oh my God, Fox, you're you're looking crazy. You're going to pay for everything you destroy. You know that. Don't you? Yes, he. And Ragnus is going to fix his room from the outside. He doesn't even know. Alright. 
That's done. Extreme breaking risk on the edge. Well, what are you going to do? And uh, you can uh, allow and pick that stuff up. You're kind of good at healing. Now we need to clean this all up. Gazelle is no longer incapable of walking. All right, that's good. So the injury made the breakdown risk again. Ragnus, well. Just go sleep. And wise, don't be stressed out because of your room, because you destroyed it. Doesn't he have any recreational things? Simon? Well, he can, he can do relaxation. But, well, what do I know? Uh, we're going to expand this zone. I definitely need one more guy here. Because we need these things to be expanded. Need more space. I guess once we have the solar, uh, this, that's going to be it for now. Because Wise has to do a lot of other stuff. You're going to eat it raw? Yes, he eat it raw. Oh my god. Uh, prioritize harvesting. You're going to prioritize. We're going to get a little bit of food stuck. That way, Wise doesn't have to eat raw food. And I guess. Howling. And then you're going to cook it. Yes, that's a good thing. Good boy, Ragnus. You're doing pretty fine. I guess Ragnus has to do everything now. But lucky we got plenty of stuff to make some good food. At least he got some food now. We definitely need another guy here because else I'm going to screw it up pretty bad animal training can we you can assign a taming animal to train in specific skills do you have skills oh you can train obedience I want to what's this the animal can be released to attack distant targets well I just want you oh that's nice if you can howl all right, we're going to teach you that. And can we teach you too? Yes, we can. So we're going to train these two gazelles. Can you do that? Can you train them? Prioritize to low need six. No, you cannot do that. I guess Ragnus can't even. No, you cannot. Oh my God. So we can't even teach these guys. Well, at least those two gazelles will defend our. Will defend us. I'll allow for pickup. And I guess Ragnus is going to need to work a bit harder. Alright, at least we got some food. Uh, made it break down risk. Yes, Ragnus, you just need to work, man. You just need to work. Do some star glazing. Where is the other guy? We're missing Fox. Where's Fox? What are you doing? Visiting graves. Alright, well, you can do that in your spare time. I guess you're visiting and respecting crazy teacher oh we can open the grave can we make zombies or something like that that would be fun
I wonder if there's any way that we can cook a little bit faster because we... Well, Ragnus does need to do a lot of things. He needs to cook. Because... Yeah, he... Why is this just eating? Not doing anything else? Can you... Can you even... You, you cannot... What can you do? Let's see your need. Know your bio. You can do... Oh, you can do the cooking. Oh, that's interesting. So, are you allowed to cook? Because, no, you're not allowed. Well, I guess you do need to cook then. And you do need to harvest and you do need to grow. Because we kind of need, we need the food now at the moment. We definitely need the food. So I guess the power needs to wait a little bit because we consume more than we can store. And I guess Ragnus is going to do the cooking thing then. And once we've got this all inside, I guess Ragnus is also going to harvest new potatoes. And I want a little bit of stock, so if we can get up to, let's say, 20, 20 would be a good number. Oh, he broke his lamp. <laughs> well, at least now we got plenty of food stored. That's six already. All right, I really need to get some tips and tricks how to get this all straightened up because we definitely going to need one more guy or girl. And uh, that way, need to find ways to save ourselves because this isn't going the right way. Got one day of work and we only got six food out of this all. We did harvest a lot, so it's kind of a question of making the food. We got dead bodies all laying all around us. All right, I guess he's going to cook now. That's also a good thing because we got a lot of raw potatoes so we can make like 30 food, I guess. Or, oh, it takes 10 potatoes for one meal. Man, you guys do know how to make potatoes. Oh, you can how. All right, didn't know that. Well, now we're getting somewhere. We're definitely getting somewhere. What can we make from corn? Because I don't know what to make with the corn. But it's not fully grown, so... And he can even harvest. That's our, our grow the potato plants. That's also a good thing. At least we got plenty of food now. That's a good thing. Definitely love having plenty of food. Right, I guess this this episode is all about food and learning that my work skills screwed up and got people killed, I guess. Yes, two people got killed by doing this. And we definitely need a new guy or someone to help us construct our base a little bit more. We need our battery space to be set up and after that we definitely going to need 
Yeah, we need a lot of stuff. We definitely need a lot of stuff. But at least we got 17. This is way better than, than last day now. So at least they are working now. Everything is growing. And we have some food. We have kind of the basic. I think it's the basic. I don't know. I This second time I played this game and the first time I got killed. So, yeah, well. I can do a lot better. I can do a lot better. I hope I can get some tips and tricks and some things to do. What's this? Oh, not again! You're going. What? What are you going to destroy? What are you going to destroy? You're going. No. Come on. Don't destroy my property. Is he kind of aggressive or something like that, Foxy? Because you're going to pay for all that. You're incapable of violent. What's this? Wise really dislikes and distrusts woman. All right, interesting. Wise life revolves around food. He gets hungry quickly and will occasionally be overcome with urge to eat. All right, interesting. It's always nice to get to know your people a little bit better. At least the cooking thing is slowly getting somewhere. But we're definitely going to need warmer clothes and we have to do something with the spaceship. I have no idea what we need to do with it or how we're going to get there. So if you get tips, tricks, or what we're supposed to go and do, go put it in the comment down below. And I would gladly try and not get killed on the process. Because that's the most important thing, not getting killed. Alright, so we got our first harvest almost in. We got 23 food, and that's 10 days of food for these guys. And they're still making stuff, so still cooking stuff. So I guess we kind of need a battery and a research so that we can... Yes, yeah, you're, you're a good guy, Rackens. Right? So you're going to put in the battery room. What just happened? What was that sound? Well, if you get tips and tricks for the major breakdown, I also would like to know how I many Ragnus isn't going to keep it up with this wooden horseshoe pin. Ain't you, Ragnus? At least we got plenty of melee weapons. I don't know what to do with them, but we got some money. And we're missing wise again. What's he, what's he doing? Did he visit the grave again? I guess he did. Fall has begun, so winter is coming. All right. I hope you guys all enjoyed this episode, and I really need those comments down below. So put those tips, tricks, and well, if you give some good tips and tricks, and you keep me growing keep me alive i will be naming you shouting you out in this video and well see you all at the next video rimworld and keep those tips and tricks coming i really need them